me in the life of Slim Twiggy. Hey everybody. So today I've got something I think is going to be pretty good and I think you're all going to enjoy it too. So I'm going to make stuffed cucumber boats. It is keto, but who doesn't like egg salad? Egg salad's good. I've got some mayonnaise, some chives, some celery, my cucumbers, paprika, a little bit of dill, and parsley flakes. So I'm going to strip some of the green off. I do like having the green on, but whatever you prefer, you do. You don't have to you don't have to leave all of it on if you do not want to. That is totally up to you. Make it your own. Tweak it how you want. But I thought this would be pretty delicious. A good uh, summertime snack. Well, you could eat this anytime. Instead of the bread, if you're cutting back on bread like myself, you could use cucumber. If you can have cucumber, because there's some people who can't even eat it. So maybe I'll strip one of the green. I'll just leave a little bit. Just a bit. I do like the taste of it. Like little pieces like that, I don't mind it at all. Cucumber sandwiches are good. <laughs> They're good, but you know, some people got to cut the stuff out of their diet, which I am one of them now. So I thought this would be something healthy that you could have. I'm going to cut this. Uh, I think I'm going to make, so that's two, four. So that will be two. Cut it in half. I think I'm just going to make this a little bit bigger. I'm going to cut this one in half, like so. Then we're going to hollow this out. Just going to hollow it out. I just got a little tiny spoon that I use. You can use a normal spoon too. It doesn't matter. And the cucumber, I'm not going to get rid of it. I'm just, I'm going to chuck it in there. You probably won't even taste it anyways. I just don't want to waste it. I don't want to waste it. So I'm going to scrape this out. I'm going to pat these dry as well with some paper towel. Just so they're not so uh, watery. Because you do want your egg salad to sit in there. And make your egg salad however you make yours. So this one is done. I think I'll only do just the just this one cucumber. I'll put this in there. The other, I'll just save it. I'll eat. I'll eat the inside of it. I'm going to grab a paper towel, which is over here. I move so much stuff in my kitchen, I can never find it half the time. Okay, I'm going to soak this up first off my cutting board. And I'm just going to pat it dry, just like so. Get another piece. Pat it dry. So it's not too watery on your on your surface or whatever you're working on. And you want your stuff to sit in your boat. So I'm going to move this over. Bring my eggs over. I probably won't use all of this. But if we have egg salad sandwiches, this will all be mixed together. I got my little egg cutter. I'll probably use my... Um, my potato masher as well. I got this little contraption from the dollar store. It doesn't work too bad actually. Like it really doesn't. Like just cutting them like that. Like this would be great for a salad too. Put that like that and then I will mush them up even more. This just gets the process going. 
Yeah, like this is dollar store stuff, so I think I'm going to invest in a really good one. I might have to, see, I might have to look on Amazon for a good, uh, a good egg cutter. But this one does the trick for now. Just like so. Oh my. There. One more. There. Perfect. Now I'll get my potato masher and we're going to crush all this. I did not have it handy with me at the time I started my video, of course. My potato masher. This will take seconds to do. Some like their uh, egg salad chunkier. I used to really make mine very, very fine. But now I like it chunkier where you can taste the egg yolk. done. I'm not adding all of these onions either, just a few. Because these I can save for uh, potatoes for breakfast in the morning. Celery. Oh, I love celery. So I'm going to put a little bit of that in there. I'm hoping I have enough uh, Hellman's Miracle Whip. There's my parsley flakes, and I got dill as well. This paprika I'm going to save for when I put the egg salad into my cucumbers. Oh my gosh, I hope I have enough. of the jars. I usually buy these squeeze bottles all the time instead of the jars. Well, let's put that there. Let's see if that's going to be enough. I don't want it too runny. I just want it enough to make it stick. As well, when I'm emptying my mayo bottles, I'll put just a dash, just a dash of milk in the bottle, shake it, and then squeeze the rest out. Yeah, there's still some in here. Don't want to waste. Things are way too expensive to be wasting anything nowadays. There we go. That should be enough. There. I'm not even sure how many eggs I boiled. I boiled quite a few. Six, seven or eight eggs I believe I did. Six at least. I know I did six for sure. I'll add just a hint of salt. I use sea salt and a hint of pepper. Okay, bring these over, move that over here. And I'm just gonna use this little spoon also so I'm going to make a few of these because I still have another one here that I don't think I'm even going to shred. I'm just going to cut. So two, four, six, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. This would be perfect for a family, a little get together. 
So I'm going to have these with supper. I might not even have supper. I might just eat these. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. But we're just going to fill these up just like so. Just like that. I know I really want to try one. I know that. They look very good. Healthy. Very healthy. And I've got quite a bit here, so I can actually load them and not be skimpy on it. Sorry about the banging there. Maybe I will use my fork instead of my finger. I could use another spoon, actually. Oh, lovely, lovely. So I'm just going to take a pinch of paprika. Sprinkle it on here, like that. These look really good. They look very good. Very healthy. Good for you. I think I'm going to try one. Like, they look so good. A cucumber boat, like a stuffed cucumber boat. I think I'm just going to cut a piece, like so. Mm-hmm. Very good. I was always, almost thinking, too, like, I like red peppers just by themselves because they're sweet. Like stuffing a pepper. That would be good. You can add a little bit more salt if you like because the salt I put in here wasn't heavy. So if you want to add more salt, add the ingredients you want to. You could even put avocado in here if you like avocado in your egg salad. Lettuce, I don't think I would put in my egg salad, but I would put shredded lettuce on here. I do like egg salad with lettuce because you don't want your egg salad to get watery and then it doesn't look good and it does, just doesn't look good. So yeah, stuffed cucumber boats. My gosh, they are, they're so good. This is keto, just so you know. I'm not on a keto diet or anything, but I wanted to try this because I like both. So, and it is very, very delicious and it is very, very refreshing. So, try some. Have a great day, guys. Bye-bye. Oh, come along the journey with me in the life of Slim Twiggy.